All right, adventurers. Welcome back to All Play. Uh, we're doing Pokemon Stadium still. We're going against the Gym Leader Castle, which is more or less uh, 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 emulation of Pokemon Red and Blue's main game, where you're fighting against the Gym Leaders in hopes of beating the Elite Four and becoming the champion. Uh, today, we're going to start our path for this week against Misty, the leader of the Cerulean Gym. This is going to be interesting. We're going for badge number two. We already got Brock's badge. We got the Boulder badge. Let's go for the Cascade badge. Uh, okay, if you don't want to know the teams, skip ahead to the time below. Again, if you don't want to know the Pokemon that I'll be choosing from, as well as the Pokemon that our opponent will be choosing from, uh, the Fisher Trainer, then I need you to skip ahead to the times below. All right. Of course, we're going to choose from our set. I guess this what this means is after I beat the gym leader, I can come back and choose another team. So if I want to switch someone out for someone that's better, then I can do that. I think that probably would be good here because if you realized it, I don't have an electric type. This is actually the first time I beat Pokemon Red and Blue without an electric type at all. The closest we have are two Pokemon that know Thunder Wave. Which isn't close enough for me, if you ask me. It's not close enough. But I think I might be able to do this without... I might be able to do this without an electric type. We have... We have uh, Winston. We can give it a run. We can give it a run. Okay. Yeah, we should be fine without an electric type here. Let's go ahead. See, slow down. Can you take a second and thank? God damn. All right. Uh, obviously, we're going to start with Winston because the entire team is weak against. Well, let's see. I think Tentacool. I think that Tentacool, Coolish, is not weak against grass simply because it's also part poison. But for the most part, the team is weak against grass. It would be dumb to start with something else. We could also send in Gladys, I want to say. Because Gladys has Thunder Wave. I believe we can send in Gladys. Uh, should I send in Max uh, Maxine as well? I feel like Maxine is probably the weakest on the team. If I were to switch anyone, it would probably be Maxine. Let's send in... Uh, how, about, how about Maxwell? Uh, let's send in Maxwell. Alright, that's our team. Here we go. Here's the first opponent of this gym series. A decisive victory is expected. <sighs> the first underling sent out a Magikarp as their first choice. I'm pretty sure Magikarp doesn't know anything but Splash. I know it can learn TMs in, in red and blue. But I'm pretty sure it just knows Splash. What's the point of splashing? I was just going to say that. Nothing but crits. Nothing but crits. Ooh, that crit, though. I mean, you sent out a magic card. What do you expect? He sent out a magic card. Oh, it's tentacle. All right. The remaining Pokemon count is three to two. Uh, tentacle. Battle is still up in the air. Let's risk it for the biscuit. It's time to be flashy. That solar beam. Hydro pump. This is not a smart. It didn't do much damage. It's not a smart. What a furious battle. Here's the beam. Come on. Ah! The bear hit. Dang. Dang. It's still not a smart. It's not very effective. It's still not a smart. Come on, come on, Winston. Let's just stick to what we know. What's that? And the weak spot. Ooh, that cr What's this? The attack wasn't effective. Why? The intense battle continues. Just finish it, Winston. Just finish it. There it goes. Come on. Yeah, it's a hit. Hey. That crit, oh. though. 
the difference in the number of reserved Pokemon. One left. Oh, it's Poliwag. Oh, it's Poliwag. The remaining Pokemon count is three to one. The pa battle has become one-sided. By the way, I'm finna get this work. Oh, no, Psychic. That's not good because we're part grass. Our first, um, we're part poison. Our first fall. Our first fall is against Misty's first jump. Uh, first underling. Okay, who's sending out for Poliwag? How about we send out this one? Let's go. Oh, it's Dragonite. <laughs> Um, combatants are making sparks fly. I have a question. Why does fly show up in purple? Is something wrong? Is something wrong? Also, my name is in purple. Uh, it doesn't matter. Let's do it. Bearing each other down. Come on. Oh, no. This is going to be one of these fights. Okay, here we go. <laughs> what is happening? Come on! What will it do? Stop! Stop being a troll! It woke up. The heated battle rages on. How about we paralyze you? Did you? What now? Thank you! Thank you, Thunderwave! Alright, paralyze it. That way, paralyze. you can't do that nonsense if we don't if we don't kill it in one shot. Let's go to work. It blew up into the sky. It's paralyzed on the spot. Alright. Give it the business. In this match. Here we go. There's the Boom. Attack. The weak spot. That crit, though. All right. And there goes the battle. We we've already hit the point where they're giving us the business. We're we're five battles in. <laughs> we're five battles in. All right. That's not bad, I guess. We lost one Pokemon so far. I mean, it had to happen sometime. Just didn't want to happen this early. If you guys enjoyed this episode of Gym Leader Castle in the Pokemon Stadium and would love to see more, then all you have to do is hit that red button below this video. That's that subscribe button. And I'll do my best to make sure you guys get to see more episodes of Gym Leader Castle in the Pokemon Stadium as well as everything else that Alt Play has to offer. Thank you guys for checking this out, and I'll catch you later with more here on Alt Play. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like and subscribe so that you can see more as soon as they come out. Thanks for watching. <laughs>